Well, I feel pretty good today. Uh, if you look directly behind me on the floor, you can see a backpack with some clothes on top of it. And uh, I'm all prepared, ready to get on one of those cruise ships. And uh, are you ready, Teddy? Teddy's ready. Uh, anxious to get aboard the ship. It'll be quite an adventure. We've been on one or two before and kind of uh, looking forward to it. But as I thought about it, there was another ship that I got aboard over 40 years ago. There had to be preparations made for my destination and things taken care of. And that ship that I got aboard was a good ship, Zion. You see, one day somebody told me that the fare had already been paid for. It was paid for by the captain. And all I had to do is, by faith, get aboard. It was good news to me, which is exactly what the gospel is. And so I got aboard the good ship Zion. Oh, as I've traveled, there's been some rough waters at times, but the ship is still heading in the same direction, and it's still going to the same destination. So, I'm glad that I'm saved. I'm glad that I'm going to be taking that ship all the way to heaven someday. The captain, Captain Jesus, will never deny anybody passage aboard. And one other thing, he's never going to throw anybody overboard. John 6, 37 says, All that the Father giveth me shall come to me, and him that cometh to me I will in no wise cast out. Well, I hope that you made your preparations and passage on the good ship Zion also, and that your destination is carried for and paid for by the Lord Jesus himself. Because someday that old ship Zion's going to sail right in. Picking up all the passengers and off we go. So get on that gospel ship. It's going to sail away. Oh, get on that gospel ship. It's going to sail away. Get on that gospel ship. And it's going to sail away. It just might be leaving here today. Get on that gospel ship. It's gonna sail away. Get on that gospel ship. It's gonna sail away. Get on that gospel ship. It's gonna sail away. Thank you.